Good morning and Happy New Year to all. I'm here up at uh, 3 o'clock in the morning making this special, special cushion. This beautiful young man that is blind and he plays the music amazingly. He loves the piano. So I decided to make him a cushion with braille. This is, I hope he loves it. So halfway through making the cushion, everybody's still asleep and I'm here making lots and lots of noise. So I will show you the finishing product soon. And this is the handle. <coughs> I decided to use fleece material because um, it's very sensitive to touch and I think it's much softer than um, other material. It's cosy and, and warm. Um, so sensory. It's okay. I'm absolutely rubbish. Is that better? Yeah. See better. So rubbish. My caffeine hasn't kicked in yet. Can you see? Oh, yeah. Right, okay. So now we'll do the edges, but we make sure that we tuck the um, handle right in so we don't sew it the wrong way around. <coughs> Okay. Don't line it up. Place it down. 
through the school of independent government at the power shell in Great Britain three years ago. The Tony will elect next speaker, a first minister from the DUP, and a deputy first minister from the <laughs> Getting to the thicker end now, so it's making a bit of a noise. I'm going to um, do the stitches again because I want to make it secure. So even though I'm doing it now, I'm going to go over it all over again. So um, I don't want to uh, don't want it to come out at any point. Make sure you leave um, a section open so you can turn the um, cushion the right way around after you finish. As I've got a zip on this one, I'm going to leave the zip on the side. I'm going to leave the zip open. I'm going to leave the zip open so I can turn it the right way around. Before I seal, I close the top with where the handle is. Again, we need to make sure that the handle's inside the material, the cushion, because I don't want to sew it on the outside and then there'll be another problem there. When I get to the handle, I like to um, do go back and forth just so I can secure the edges of the handles. On the because, you know, kids carry them and swing them around, so you want to make sure that it's actually doubly secured.
<clears throat> okay, so that's all sealed there. I'm going to go over the cushion all over again to cut out the excess material and anything that just sticking out. So I'm going to sew all around it to secure. This is the handles that was sticking out. It's always leave a few inches out just so I can secure it in. And um, we'll get back to you in a moment. Alright, so I've sewn all around, tidied up the threads within the like this, all of these little bits to be cut off. So all these little threads just tied it up. So we're going to turn it round. Welcome to my living room. See the zip is there, so I had to do the zip. I put the zip at the bottom. And push the corners out. And there we go. Now it's a pocket to here as well. And now I'm just going to stuff the cushion inside and we see what the finished product looks like. There's a bit more thread there. and snug in here. think that is impressive a lovely little and I hope Davy absolutely enjoys it and has much fun putting his books pajamas anything in here with a handle I absolutely love the material it was so soft oh, I had fun with my best friend which is a brother Nova ISV5 and doing what I like to do <clears throat> and now having to go and start my motherly duties breakfast and clubs and everything else thank you for joining me have a good day bye bye